Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Real Talk with B. Uh, I'm excited to be here. It's a long time coming, but we finally here. So let's enjoy this ride together. So let me start this off by giving a quick shout out to my mother. Kicking it with Lynn. Go like, share, subscribe. Go on and catch a vibe. That's what she's going to say to y'all on there. Anyway, it's a good platform. It's a mukbang. Mukbang, yeah, so... You know, and she talks about real life stuff. So, yeah, go check that out. And uh, so anyway, you know, I'm on here hoping to vibe, give knowledge, gain some knowledge. Uh, the good thing about these platforms is you can reach a lot more people than you could, you know, um, with anybody else. So um, hopefully I vibe with y'all. Y'all vibe with me. Uh, and we can learn off each other and just, you know, grow together. Uh, during this pandemic, you know, um, speaking of the pandemic, you know, it's a sad thing right now going on and, uh, we just all got to kind of come together and do things, you know, such as this, you know, talk to each other, relate, debate, whatever it is we do on here, you know what I'm saying? To where we keep our time and our minds occupied and still gain knowledge within it. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, real talk with B is going, it's going to be about that, you know, my real talk your real talk and then we can have some real fun in between you know what i mean so uh i look forward to you know meeting a lot of you guys uh talking with you guys learning with you guys and i think we'll have some fun on here so uh i don't plan on keeping you guys on long today you know uh, this is me just introducing myself to you guys and uh like i said uh and we can go from there um Back to this pandemic thing, though, right? Um, we would have thought that, you know, it would have been a better handle on it so far, right? But uh, I think those in power got some things they got to work out. You know, I'm really not going to get into too much today about it. But we'll talk about a lot of things on different videos. But I feel like a lot of people, including myself, are getting through this the best way they can, you know. And uh, that's all we can do, you know. Uh, you know, we put God first. We got our family. We put them in uh, first, you know. And we just live through that, you know. A lot of people are worrying about, you know, what's the government going to do? What's everybody else going to do? What's this person doing? Uh, why they don't have, you know, I, I don't really read into too much politics. Uh, I know enough. Um, and uh, my concern is my household. Long as long as we are taking care of our household, we don't have to really too much worry about what nobody else is doing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said, uh, san sanitizing, you know what I'm saying? Lysol, disinfectant, whichever brand you got. Um, what else they got? Uh, hand sanitizers, bleach, uh, cleaning your house on a daily basis. That is um, a key thing. You know what I mean? Um uh, and if people aren't doing that, then I suggest y'all get on up there and start, you know, cleaning a lot more. Not saying y'all don't. I'm just saying, you know, you want to protect yourself during this pandemic. And I think it starts with home. You know what I'm saying? We we let, we got to worry about what other people are doing, especially in times where we send our kids to school and we expect the schools to, um, you know, administer the things that they're supposed to. You know, whether it's the, the legal stuff where six feet uh hand sanitation stations or whatever the case may be lysol wipes in between the class periods you know us parents we expect them to do that you know our our kids are going to school you know some of them some of them are doing the virtual thing you know uh i have kids that are going to school and i have one that's doing virtual so you know it's a constant battle every day uh putting your faith in the people you know what i'm saying but self-sanitize you know uh but at the end of the day, you know, I think it's this more self thing. As long as we're doing what we're supposed to do, um, it lessens our risk and our chances of, you know, contracting, you know, coronavirus. Uh, but like I said, in, in prayer, you know what I'm saying? Prayer. Heck, I even, um, I got anointing oil from my pastor and I put it on my kids. I put it on me too, you know? So, you know, everybody does what they do, you know what I'm saying, to, to feel better about this situation. And I just so happen to feel better, you know, whenever I put God in my situations, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, 
I don't know. Just stay skeptical about everything. But at the same time, don't fall prey to, you know, just being negative. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? You got to try to have a smile on your face through this. You know what I'm saying? No matter how hard it is, you got to keep a smile on your face. Like I said, just start at home preparations, man. Just just sanitize your home, clean your home, uh, Lysol, you know, um, if you got family member or, you know, whatever the case may be, Lysol, as soon as they come in, as soon as they leave, you know, ain't nothing wrong with that. You know, I keep a, uh, you know, the, the, the vial, the squirt things of the uh, hand sanitizer on my counter. So if somebody comes over my house immediately, uh, can you sanitize, please? You know what I'm saying? You know, everybody laughs now, but, you know, it, it's serious, though. You know, sanitize. Right now, that, that's that's key to, um, you know, fighting against this thing. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? I believe COVID is real. Um, whether it's a, whether, I don't know exactly what kind of virus it is. They say, you know, super flu or it's his own little virus. Whatever the case may be, God got us anyway. But, uh, you know, whatever it may be, you know. We just got to fight it like we fight anything else every day, you know. We fight a lot of things every day. Um, just stay prayed up, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said, I ain't trying to talk your head off on this introduction video. But, uh, <laughs> you know, that's something that, you know, we can all relate to, you know. So, uh, let's just keep uh, let's keep everybody in our prayers. You know what I'm saying? Me, you, y'all, your family, you know, they family, friends, everybody. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I'll, I'll, I'll pray for you guys, you know what I'm saying? Y'all pray for me, and hopefully we can all get through this and, you know what I'm saying, be greater at the end of it, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said, I ain't going to keep you on here too long, but my name is Brandon, and this is Real Talk with B. Look forward to talking to you guys in the future. Uh, I'll be uploading these videos, y'all, so pay attention, watch, listen, and let's just... Uh, Let's just understand and keep growing together. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, get on there. Uh, Real Talk with B. Like, share, subscribe. And I appreciate you and I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.